every time I grab one of these little carts, those comes a rolling, one comes a rolling out at me. I have my bag. I don't plan on buying too many things today, but, just, but we'll see. Ah! Look what caught my eye. I wonder if we have the little velvet pumpkins. Okay, before I head in over there, let me go in my... No, let's go check it out quickly. So here are the plates you guys have been seeing that I've shared with you. The little striped black and white ones. Super cute. You can really change up your seasons with them because they're so versatile. And I think I'm going to grab one of these little gray t-shirts. They're really nice and thin. Great for around the house. Doing some gardening. Um, just a nice simple gray t-shirt. Maybe black. Okay, I have to come here and see if there's any of the little velvet pumpkins right away, but there aren't. There's these little guys here. They're not really my style like, for fall, so I'm going to have to easily pass on these, but I will be looking for the little fabric ones. And I'll share with you what else is on the stand here, but it's kind of crazy that we're in August already, and here we are. It's fall, maple leaves little decorum so okay I'm gonna go back to where I normally start so I feel okay there's some wire wreath, wreaths hanging here as well for your for you crafters but um, well for us crafters this looks tasty lemon ring pie one of my favorite pies but not in pudding actual pie anyways I think I'm gonna go back to the other side of the store um, so we can kind of have my regular routine otherwise I'm, oh my goodness these are so cute. I don't need another coffee mug. Okay, now I'm super excited to see all these new things. Look at those adorable little pumpkins. Oh, I really like these ones. Last year they had a little bit different pumpkins. They were a little flatter, more like these, these kinds here. I like this blue one. I think I have to grab this for my house because my decor is all blue super cute napkins great for a nice Thanksgiving dinner and our Thanksgiving is celebrated in October in Canada but I think Thanksgiving is celebrated in November if I'm not mistaken in the US okay so here's so I'm back to the beginning here trying to get back to the school supply area but there's fall flowers look at these purple ones so many new flowers for wreaths and all sorts of stuff now I'm kind of in a crafting mood I might have to do something what I do not know but at least these are so cute too anyway so we'll just go through here and then see if there's oh they put some more napkins here last year I did a cute um, DIY using one of these felt pumpkins on a piece of wood it turned out so so nice I still have it and love it these are cute too I also did a transformation of one of these signs last year for the autumn or for fall and it turned out really nice as well. These are really pretty. Almost like looks like a metal decal that's wrapped across it but it's not. Hmm, I wonder what we could use here. Oh, this one is nice. Looks like a little metal thing here, right? Honestly, like, I think I need to have, oh, these ones are cute, they're little wrapped in like a, so I shared this in my last walkthrough, because all the Christ, um, back to school supplies were just put out, now they're already starting to dwindle, like almost, like everything seems to be selling really fast, so if you need anything, these are, those small binders are great for uh, DIY sticker organization that I've shared on the channel. These are really cute even for a cart. If you have a little craft cart, those will hold things neat and tidy. And there's a full Crayola stand. 
I'm so particular about my coloring pages, but I do like Crayola products. Just um, I like nice thick white coloring pages. Some leftover barbecue, summer items still kicking around here. These are really light. I'm not sure if they're spill proof, but uh, they're BPA free. And these have eight paper plates. Oh, these are fun. When we went to the Milwaukee game, the kids got one of these little light up sticks, except it says bucks on it and everything, but <laughs> they're fun. The kids like them. They still play with them till this day. So these are the blue and white plates. These ones here are 50 cents. Oh, I see. There's a little chip, but um, they sold out really quickly. So fast. I'm gonna get a little hamburger package here. Can't really beat this price even on sale at the grocery store. I think we pay Someone was recommending that I clean my shower glass doors with The Works. I believe it's a toilet bowl cleaner. I'm looking, has anyone seen them at Dollar Tree? I have never noticed. I think it's called The Works Toilet Bowl Cleaner. I will ask one of the associates. Oh, also cleaning vinegar. Make sure like when you're using it that it's a 5%, like a pure cleaning vinegar, because that's what's going to give you that nice streak-free cleaning effect. Is this normally stocked at Dollar Tree? Anyways, yeah, if you've seen any of the works toilet bowl cleaner, I would love to try it. I'm just not sure that I've ever seen it. This is so cute. I wish it matched my craft room, but it's so sweet and super, super heavy. Very sturdy. Some cute signs here today. Look what we have here, my favorite little llamas. And they look like they're intact. The only thing they need is a little bit of E6000 to get them standing back up. Oh, you're coming home with me, sweet little llamas. They're so sweet, I love them. They're my favorite from all of the little trinket dishes.
I still haven't had any luck to find the gel super glues. I don't know why they didn't restock those. Looks like you get two bonus bags in these little packages. So there's 15 bags in total. Used to be 13. There's no slider, they're just a snap zipper seal. These sold out really fast. This was completely stocked here. Um, and completely sold out. We tried these blueberries about a week or so ago and they did not last. My husband really enjoys the coffee beans and now I found some blueberry ones. So he's not really a sweets person. So when I find something tasty, I definitely swipe it. Look at this. I'll go through the nails to show you. I know some of you really like looking at all the nails available here. Oh, this looks like a... These are cute. I like the little pineapples and you can take them apart and make something cute. This looks like a brand that I've never seen before. So I don't know if anyone has any feedback on it, but it looks like Millie. Looking, sometimes things are made in Canada. No, nope, made in China. If anyone's, um, has any feedback on these, I'd appreciate it. Okay, we need to take a moment here. Do you see these with the little wood tags? Do you see them? How many do I need? Oh my goodness. These are so cute. There's like a little vase.
Oh, this looks new. Oh, made in Canada. I love when I find products that are made in Canada. That just makes me happy. I bought a pack of these before once for the car. They're so thin, I would never repurchase them. Somebody dropped some stuff on the floor here. Pity Pity, and it's made by Clubhouse. They are a little small, and this one's the Southwest Chipotle. Pure white vinegar, 5% is what you need for a nice streak-free cleaning of mirrors. Oh boy, look what's back. Happy Swings, my favorite. Coconut are actually my favorite. Oh my gosh, so tasty. But if you don't like sweet things, then definitely don't buy them. But they're super sweet. Oh, this is a nice little find. Okay, I must say that every time I've walked down this aisle, I have not been disappointed. Here's a five pack of face cloths and they're nice quality. I'm going to grab some for my son. Oh, I'll know that they're his because they're colored. I always like to have like something to identify hers and his. These would be great for a pet as well. Like if you need to give your dog a bath, those towels are perfect. Oh, I like these for my drawers. They make the clothes smell nice, if you like lavender. Oh, wow. These are a brand name. How do you say it? Sakani? Su? No. I forget. Skunsi? Skunsi? I forget the name of this company and how to pronounce it. Look at all this. Ec oh my goodness. And I have to take a peek through here for myself and for my daughter. I'm going to have to bring her in so she can pick out some fun things because I just don't know what color she would like the most. There's so many fun little items. Look, the mermaid ones, the scrunchies. Oh, this is so old school. A little head wrap. Oh look, they have Goody too. I love that brand. That's what I use my, my hair ties. That's the brand I buy for hair ties, hair elastics. 
I wish there wasn't pink. If it was more black, I'd buy one of those. I also love these container. Oh, there's what is this? Wizard pads, nail polish remover. By the way, has anyone ever tried the Dollar Tree nail polish remover? Does it work well? I need some more, and I usually buy acetone, but I ran out. Oh my goodness, look, I was just asking about this, and here it is, restocked. I made some really cute DIYs using this for um, eyelash trim. I think eyelash yarn trim. There's so many new supplies here in the craft area, too. So for a while, it was quite bare, and now look at this. Even, like, popsicle sticks are already painted for you. You don't even have to paint things. They're white, black, all sorts of... Oh. Here's some um, wood pieces as well. So there's like the unicorns, there's the, the little stars I think I saw last time. Oh, the crown. So if you want to do like a little bedroom sign for a boy or a girl or whatever, it doesn't matter. But like if you wanted to decorate, especially for a little baby, these are awesome for making reverse canvases. I've done some really cute DIYs with these as well on the channel. And paints belong over here. It's a really pretty purple, by the way. And I've used this pink, and I kind of mixed it with other colors just to give it a more pale pink at one point. Tacky glue, it's nice to see it restocked, and the Mod Podge as well. I know a lot of you have been buying the little glitter. C'est la vie, Dawn's channel, Dawn Thompson. She has um, collected all of these glitters. I thought it was so cute. Okay. So I've seen the little pencil cases for these and I love the little prints. Although they're not great for sharpening, I avoid buying pencils that have this wrap on it, but I think I'm gonna have to get myself these pencils because they're just, the print is too cute. I can't pass up the little owl and foxes. If you've seen um, a review on the channel, I have shared those other pens with you and I know some of you were looking for them so they are still available and I even think the packaging has changed again if I recall at a different store I saw them and nice to see some of these zebra emul emulsion pens emulsion zemulsion I'm not sure what they're going for there but I'm looking forward to trying those out they look really good has anyone tried them at all there are blue and there are black ones like these well, I hope you enjoyed walking through, seeing some of the new fall items. I'm super excited to see what's coming to the stores now in the next few weeks. And until next time, everyone, I do look forward to sharing my haul with you guys. And thank you so much for watching. Bye for now.